looks like we're working. So happy for Zach and Sally. Hey, you know, it was something I thought about last night when I was um, painting um, Jack last night on the live. It just came to my head. Oh my God. And Denise, who was here during the live, I think she had the same idea because we were talking and I'm like, oh my God, I'm thinking about something special. And she's like, a Jack and Sally. And that was what I wanted to do. So I went ahead and painted this the Bahama Blue, which is the same color that I did. If you didn't watch last night's live, I did the Queen of Hearts, which she's all ready. She's just waiting for the wig. But I used Bahama Blue on her eyes, eyelids. I love the color. And I did get her crown made. It's a cute little crown. So she's just waiting for the wig. All right. So this is kind of what I have in mind. I don't know if it's going to work. I hope so. Hi, Lourdes. Um, I did a jack. I didn't even cut off his tag. And he is... He's all sealed. I might do a little more black there. Um, it's going to be super simple. And I'm going to do her. I just drew her. So I'm going to paint her. And I cut the bottom. I usually use dowels. But I'm not going to have heavy big arrangements on it. So I'm just going to shove it right in. Like that. And then I have a, a couple of... I painted some of uh, fall leaves. I have to do some touch-ups. Painted some of them black. And I'll put them around and some ribbon um, and then maybe uh, one of these bats will go on top of his head just something cute and simple and then instead of because um, it's not going to be top heavy it could just sit on a on a stand thingy so we'll just get started and uh, see how it goes so I'm going to save her hair for last otherwise I can't touch it so I'm just going to start by outlining and see how it goes. And hopefully if you leave a comment and I don't respond, please forgive me. That's just because Facebook screws up a lot, but I will go back and look just in case I miss any. Alright, so I'm going to use a liner and get her outlined. Hopefully the eyes are even. Her, the eyes are really difficult to, to get even. You want to draw them like um, angled lemons. That's the easiest way I can describe it. I'm just going to do a light one first because I got to go all white inside. And then I'll go over this outline again. This is a bad brush. It's a crappy brush. Let's try this one. One thing about when you're working on these pumpkins that you get from Michaels, you got to be really careful. It's hard to correct your your flaws on them. It's not like wiping off on a styrofoam. However, I am using my only base color. So, by using my only base color, I could do touch-ups a lot easier. For example, like this, unless you can find an off-white that's very similar, you're going to have problems doing touch-ups. Good afternoon, Virginia. Okay, so hopefully, like I said, hopefully these eyes are close in size. As long as they're close enough, you know. It's 
So this will be a, a cute little Halloween centerpiece or arrangement. I would, actually, I'm off. I'm a little bit off. I can see it. I am a little bit off. So, this should have been up higher. Probably about right there. So, let me see if I can fix it. So, it's not even as high as it should. What I'll do is I'll bring the white out there more. Okay. Thank you. I have sometimes trouble on making those angled lemons. But and like I said last night, if you have a lot of trouble doing it, the best thing to do is cut a pattern, you know, and then outline it, flip it over and do it on the other side. I probably should have did that. But. It's alright. We'll see how it looks when she's done. So, I was hoping to go live tonight. Sally and Billy Jack is out of the picture. Who's Billy? <laughs> um, I wanted to do... A devil lady so I'm hoping after dinner I can go live and do that pretty excited about making her a devil lady I don't have a name for her yet but she's gonna be a devil lady And they have the little horns and stuff. So keep an eye out if I make it live tonight. And I'd super appreciate it if you would share the video. Oh, thank you so much, Lisa, for the stars. I super appreciate it. Anybody sending stars, thank you so much. It's very helpful. Anything I make and stop for stars goes directly to my crafting, to creating these heads, supplies, and everything. It does get hard sometimes trying to keep up with supplies. So I really appreciate it. So, so I'm not going to do her eyelashes yet because I'm actually going to bring her eyelashes over her hair. Now you can, at Michael's, they do sell the teal colored. Thank you for sharing, Virginia. They do sell the, sh the teal colored pumpkins. Um, you could always use one of those for a Sally. Um, however, I haven't seen them in the tiny, the tiny ones, which I think are these are six inches. And they're a little darker than her regular color but still it'll work still will work so just outlining her lips go in a little bit Close enough. Alright, now we'll do just 
just a little tiny curve here. Just to have the lip separation. could have been shadowed but I'll do it like that okay so now I'm gonna do let's do the white of her eyes because that might take more than one coat yeah it's gonna take more than one don't worry if you go out of the lines, it's okay. You could always do your touch-ups after it's all dry. I think two coats should be sufficient for that. We'll see. I was pretty excited. I went to Spirit and I was actually able to find another red hat like the one I had in the Halloween auction. The highest selling head. They had one. I'm sorry. It was not Spirit Halloween. I thought I had gotten it at Spirit Halloween but I saw it at Party City. And they had one left and I grabbed it. Okay, so I'm going to give that a second to dry. While that's drying, I'm sorry, you're talking about Y&R. Lisa, I didn't see a comment from Lisa about Y&R. I must have missed something. No, I don't see anything. All right, I'm going to do her lips. For some reason, all the, t the comments don't always show up. I'm hoping that this live copied over to my group. Being that it's a whole new setup, I don't know if it did. Okay. I'm going to use my Tuscan Red for her lips. And I'm not going to get fancy and, and do the like blending in between the top lip and bottom lip because she's more of a cartoon, you know, so I think just leaving it like this will look nice. And that's the way her pictures look anyway. Oh, good. Lisa notifications went out that I was live. That's good. 
I wasn't sure because everything was so different. finger and eyeball. Okay, that's the coat on her lips. Now I'm going to go back to her eyes. It dries pretty fast. Hi, Jamie. Jamie, do you know if this um, showed up in group, this live? Because Facebook has a whole new setup now for going live and I was super confused and I always have it copy over to the group and um, Lisa said she got notification that I went live so that's good but I just didn't know if the actual live showed up in group. I guess I could actually look. I didn't even think to look. actually may need a third coat on this eyeball but that's okay because it dries super fast I don't know I got a notification okay that's good as long as the notifications um, Lisa said she got hers too so that's good that's good So I think these heads would look super cute just sitting next to each other. Um, and I was going to leave them like that, but I thought, nah, I'm going to stack them and see how it looks. So we'll see. Then I also have my, uh, my other pumpkin I did. This guy. This guy, I have a... I have this pumpkin that I'm going to do a face so he can sit on top of him and then he'll be ready. I, I love him. I think he's super cute. <laughs> super cute. Alright, I'm going to give that a chance to dry. And I'll go ahead and start my outline, at least, of the hair. Good. Virginia got notification, too. Awesome. That's good. As long as the notification's working. So anybody that just joined or didn't hear, I'm hoping to go live tonight to do a double lady. We'll just see. I'm going to try. Because I really want to get it made. So again, I'm going to do the eyelashes over her hair. Just getting this outline. Kind of wanted to get her eyes done first before I do the hair because then there's nowhere for me to put my hands. Where did my picture go? I'm just waiting for the eyeballs to dry so I can do another coat. You know, another thing you could do with these pumpkins, because they are cuttable, you can actually just cut them right in half and hang them on your wall. Wouldn't that look cool? Uh, 
All right, let me oh, a little bit more. I'm just waiting for the eyeballs. A little bit more here. Sorry if you're annoyed by wind chimes. I love wind chimes. And it's really hot in here. My window's open, so I know that you're probably hearing it a lot. Okay, I think the eyes are dry enough to where I could go in and do my second coat. Then I'll use a bigger brush to get the hair done. I'm just passing time. All right, let's see. Hopefully, hopefully this will be the last coat. I'm kind of surprised. And I'll do another coat on... Um, I'm letting it dry enough. Oh, you love the sound. Good. Oh, and Lisa said soothing. Awesome. I know some people don't care for him, like my husband, Ron. He don't like him. But I said, I'm sorry. I love wind chimes. I've always had wind chimes. I think they're very relaxing, soothing also. one I'm gonna have to let dry a little more all right let me do another coat on her lips oh thank you Vicki thank you I'm really hoping that um, my idea of Stacking them will look cute. Gonna make it simple without a lot of extras on it. Like last year, I I put a lot of extras. It turned out really nice, but I just wanted to do it simple. Okay, I'm live right now. Okay. Okay. Bye. I didn't let my husband know I was going live. <laughs> okay. I'm going to go ahead and just try to do that hair because I need to let that dry more. So I'm going to jump to a bigger brush. Let me. Where's my paper? Go like this. I'll just be all 
doing it the naughty way. And I will go all the way around, but I'm not going to do it right now because then I will not be able to hold it. Not be able to hold it. I hate it when the paint ends up getting lumpy. It's time to open a new bottle of Tuscan Red. It's looking like her. Hi, Renee. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. not going to go all the way to the bottom, just enough to the what is seen. Let me try one more coat of white. I really want the white. Um, to be solid without any of the blue showing. I think we finally made it like four coats. Remember, if you got any ridges, get rid of them. They don't look good. think that's good enough. Just wait for this red to dry and then we can do the eyelashes. Shoot. Let's go over that. So let me put a little highlight um, on her bottom lip. Where's the one to 
so love Jack and Sally. I love Jack and Sally decor. Oh, Spirit Halloween has a lot of cute uh, Jack and Sally stuff. And Party City has the little stuffed, well, they're not little. They're kind of tall stuffed dolls of, the, of them. This is the stupid one. Why do I grab the stupid one? Do a simple little curve just to give a little highlight there. Okay, so now, fun part. Just kidding, it's not fun. The part where you try to get those darn eyeballs. Now, if you have one of those brushes that are flat, they're like on a stick and they're 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 round flat. You just go ping. You have the fourth. I want those. You have the fourth. I'm not sure the conversation. I might have missed something. I bought quite a few Jack and Sally and zero figures from Walgreens. I'm not sure if you're talking what you're saying, Jamie. If she might be talking to somebody else. I don't know. Let me know. I did a wreath with Big Jack. Oh, I bet you that turned out awesome. I did a wreath of Jack and Sally, I think last year. And it turned out so cute. I bought quite a few Jack and Sally and some of those figures from Walgreens. Awesome. Walgreens actually has some cute little Halloween stuff when they set out. It's always good to check Walgreens. All right, I'm just trying to find a, a good liner to do my four foot not fourth you have the four foot I want those oh are you talking you must be talking to Lisa okay where is my lid here it is okay so I'm going to try. I'm going to start with a dot. I'm going to look directly at her so I can make her pupils like she's looking at me. There's one. Might be a little small, but at least I get it on there first. All I can say is do a forward C and a backward C if you have trouble doing um, circles. That will help you get um, a circle. Okay, now I'm going to darken up her top eye line. I'm sorry, I thought you said you had the fourth of Jack and the four foot Jack and Sally of Jack and Sally. Oh, I don't have it myself. Party City uh, has the really big ones. I love those. They're awesome. Okay, I'm going to darken the top line. When I say darken, I meant thicker. <sighs> I didn't mean to say darken. Make it thicker. So it looks like she has eyeliner. So a little bit, but. Let's see, there's a difference there. She
Thank you. Thank you, Lisa. Thank you, Jamie. She looks super cute for being a pumpkin head. Just kind of fixing my line here. Just makes me nervous because it's not, like I said, it's not easy to fix your flaws on the pumpkin. All right, so now time for her eyelashes. I'm going to use my number, what is this, two? I don't know what it is. I don't know. Let me use this brush. Probably not going to get the other side looking just right. I always, the other one's always harder. Let's see. Hold on a second. Okay, that's close enough. Sometimes I end up slanting the other side the wrong way or too slanty and just push. That one's longer, but I think it's okay. Nobody's eyelashes are perfect, right? Okay. Um, just gonna do a little. I'm gonna do a little touch up around because Jack is gonna be attached up here. So I'm gonna paint all of this back here red but I don't want to do it all right now because then I can't work with it. But I need this part that's going to be a jack attached to her. I need that part done. Otherwise, I won't be able to get in there and paint it. So I'll just get that part done for now. She's going to look a lot better too once she's sprayed. can't spray her till I just fully dries and then I wipe all of the um, pencil. Not unless you're a Kardashian level. Oh, I know. The Kardashians. <laughs> they have some amazing eyelashes. You could always add a little blue highlight, not highlight, blue shadow, eyeshadow around the eye. Um, I'm actually not going to do that, but you can. All right, so I say let's go ahead, go ahead and attach, attach them. I think they're cute by themselves, but I already had the plan to attach them, so I'm just going to go for it, and hopefully it'll look. It'll look okay. We'll see. I don't know. We shall see. And again, normally I attach with dowels. This one, I'm not because I'm not going to have any heaviness to it. Um, I'm not even going to attach this to that stand because it makes it harder to ship. 
so I'll just include the stand in the shipping and then she could just sit on the stand because see how she's balanced quite well and when he goes on there you know let me zoom out so you're going to be able to see what I'm doing <clears throat> you might have to get all the view of my computer as well Water. I'm just waiting for my ca my camera to load so I can zoom out. It doesn't want to load. There it is. Let's see. You'll be able to see my live. Seems crooked. Okay. So this is what I plan on doing. I cut a square instead of doing a, you know, drilling a hole for the dowel. I just cut a square and I'm just going to load her up with hot glue and attach her this way. Attach them together this way. I have to look at it straight on so I make sure it's even. So give me a second. Okay. One sec. Hopefully it'll work. I haven't used hot glue to attach. But like I said, I'm not doing anything heavy, you know, so I don't really think it's going to be a problem. Just give it a second to dry. Interesting. You can see the glue. I don't like that. It's not what I wanted. Give me a second. Hopefully they're even. Who knows? Who knows? Okay. Let me hold it here for a second. I do have some stuff I'm going to wrap around it so um, we don't have to worry if it still continues to show. <sighs> okay, I got to give this a second to dry so I can kind of work with it. I'm going to have to tie around. So just bear with me I'm gonna actually use the restroom um, and give this a chance to dry I'll be right back
Okay. Okay. Sorry. Um, now, I have some things I want to add. I did not have any black raffia. And couldn't find any. Stores didn't have them. Actually, I didn't go to Hobby Lobby. They might have had some. So I took some uh, dark chocolate brown that I had. Um, put a bunch of Mod Podge on it. Put a bunch of black glitter and some black paint and it still actually has a slight chocolatey look but I like it so I'm gonna use a little bit of this bear with me because it's kind of crispy because I used Mod Podge and I only want to use a little bit let me cut some. But I kind of like, you know, it's very Halloween-y. Even though it's not solid black, it's pretty groovy. All right. Save the rest of this. Could always add more. I need to. I don't know. I think it's hi Terry. Something different. Definitely something different. Okay. See so. So I tell you, you could have fun playing with Ra Raphia. You know. Get a bunch of Mod Podge on there, throw some glitter, paint it. I still gotta spray this, but I'm gonna go ahead and uh, uh, hold on, I'm thinking right now. My mind's thinking because I do. Oh, look at how it just bends and stays. Isn't that cool? I will use a. Um, I hope I can find him. A floral pin. A long run there. Do you have some ribbon? Let's see. I think the ribbon would look better mixed in with it. Let's see. Gonna mix the ribbon in it. I don't know, we'll see. I won't know unless I try. Can't really see it. Something different, I guess. for my floral pin. Turn this one this way. Hmm. I don't know. I'm going to go ahead and stick it in and see.
Oh, awesome, Terry. Awesome. And then I painted some um, fall leaves. Could use a little touch up, but I can deal with that. Gosh, dang it. So I'm going to take some hot glue just right on the edge there. Please, if you haven't shared, I'd love for you to share. Um, my videos don't get really good algorithm. I don't know why. Don't know why. I think I'll put another one a little off to the side. One right over here. Thank you, Denise. Remember what we talked about last night? I just had to do it, Denise. I just had to. Just had to. So, not super fancy, you know, not super fancy at all, but something different. Where is my bats? I want to put a bat. I was just showing you guys the bats. Hold on. I lose everything, I swear. And everything's right in front of me, but I lose it all. One second. Where did the bats go? Wow, can you guys see the bats? Because I don't see them. I just had them. Super even. Really? There they are. I know, Terry, I can finally see your comments. And strangely, um, Facebook is being stupid for me. It's, it's a whole new live thingy. When I had to uh, cancel my first one because I couldn't even understand what was going on. It's not the same setup as before. So I just thought a cute little bat, like right on top. You can see the whole thing. Okay. Uh, let me see. Just looking here, just looking. Nope, don't like it. All right. Interesting, interesting, different. Um, so what I'm going to do is I need to, um, 
wipe off the pencil and then I need to um, gloss her and then I'll take a picture then you guys will get to see what she looks like totally or she and he he she something different it's pretty cool and then don't forget tonight I'm going to try to go live to do um, a devil. Oh, look at Denise. Party City. I found it. I found another hat. I can't wait to do that one. Um, where's my Party City bag that I was going to show you what I have for the devil lady. Spider. I didn't do a spider. Hold on. And I don't know why, but I don't see my bag that has the devil lady stuff. Maybe I left it in the other room. But let's do a spider. Are you doing another head like the other one, or is that for the devil one? No, the devil one. Um, is going to be different. She's going to have a red and black wig. She's going to have horns on her forehead. And then she has uh, this groovy like headband. The red hat's not for the devil lady. Why won't this come off? It's always good to buy a package of spiders during Halloween for your creations. Alright, let's take a look. All right, so he has a bat. What do you think about a spider right there on her cheek? Honest opinion, what do you think about a spider on her cheek? I don't know if that would be too much for him. This might help balance, you know, because she's got stuff going on this side. Right there. Terry says no, no spider on the cheek. Do you think I should have a spider? Spider or no spider? Denise says no, Terry says no. Okay, gosh, I'm gonna just say no then. However, if somebody buys them, I can always add the spider and they could just set it down on the little stand right there can't see it though very well no no spider Lisa says maybe on the base okay we will leave it off and just on the base um Denise said let me look up here Hold on. so you're doing another head like the red hat lady I was thinking about doing one similar to the Red Hat Lady and uh, getting the silver gray wig also because I think those wigs are awesome. I think it just goes beautifully with a red hat. So that's what I was thinking about doing. Um, but anyway, if I can find my stuff, I'm going to try to do the Devil Lady tonight. Also, I need to do... Like I was showing you guys, I have this guy, and I want to do um, another face so that he can sit on top. I have to cut it so he can sit on there, and then he'll have um, he'll have these fall leaves around, you know, and stuff. So I still got to do that too. Lisa said, no spider, just no spider. <laughs> there will be no spider, just like that. So I'm going to clean it up, spray it, and uh, take a picture of the final result. I'm not 100% happy, honestly. Um, 
It's just, I think it's just really different looking. I, I don't know. I'm not 100% happy. I love the orange pumpkin. So I gotta do that too. Um, maybe I'll do this live tomorrow. I don't know. Because I really want to do that devil lady. So anyway, I will see you guys this evening. If not, then I'll do it tomorrow. But my goal is to do the devil lady tonight. I'm still prepping her head. So everybody have a wonderful evening. And thank you so much for the stars. And thank you for sharing. I will talk to you guys later. Bye-bye. And Terry, I'm so glad I can finally see your comments. I'm definitely going to try, Denise. <laughs> Talk to you soon.